At CES, we expect the crowds and we expect the autonomous vehicles, but we don't necessarily expect an autonomous mobile rumpus room that can accommodate a crowd. Let's discuss. Hey, Shahara. Hi. Can we talk about the e-palette? Give us oh. the lowdown. What's it all about? Okay, so the first thing that I always say, and I, you know what, I think you know what Amazon is, don't you? Okay, so this is the idea that no longer do you have to go to the store, but the store now comes to you. So that's what the big premise, the big idea is about the e-palette. The second big idea is nobody has to drive it. Okay, so this is fully autonomous using Toyota's chauffeur mode technology. And the next thing that's really cool about it for all my techies out there, now our partners, our users, like Amazon, you may have heard of them, or Pizza Hut, or Uber. Right behind you. Yeah, anybody. Or anybody, they can use their own automated driving system, and it's implemented into our own system, which we call Toyota Mobility Services Platform. Now, that sounds techy, but what I'm saying is, all those people that are just walking behind me, if they had their own automated driving system, they can embed it into our system, meaning the e palette, and then our system will automate everything, manage everything. It kind of acts as a safety net, which we call our guardian technology technology to make sure everything is running just the way it should. Gotcha. Okay, so let's uh, let's get down so a little what bit. What does it mean for you? Yeah, tell what me. does it mean for all the rest of the people? Yeah. Okay, so what happens is is now like I said, we don't have to go to the store anymore. So these can be used for ride sharing, deliveries, logistics, e-commerce, retail, and hotel and home services. So basically, this is a vehicle that now has autonomous driving and can meet the needs of all the different services, the different exchanging. And in addition to that, you can take a number of these different e-pallets, configure them together, and create an e-hub. Have you heard of that like Burning Man festival that they put out like in the desert? Sure have. Yeah? So this is what happens. You can take a bunch of those and put them out into the desert. They can move around, shuffle people around. Uh, let's say, for example, Toyota, we want to get people more engaged with it. We can create a lounge. So you have three different sizes, and then for each of our users, it has an open layout concept, so you can actually design it the way that you want to design it to meet your needs. Okay, so uh, we could use this as uh, something like a bus, or we could use yep. it as something like a food truck. Yep. Uh, could this bring me uh, delivery of fresh vegetables from the uh, food service that I've subscribed to? Why don't you just do my job? You got it. <laughs> uh, so this is the e-palette concept. I'm going to tell you all about it. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, but, no. Uh, okay. no, you have it absolutely right. So it's it's taking mobility and taking it to the next level. Toyota's always looking into the future and seeing it's not just driving from point A to point B anymore. We don't have to drive anymore. We don't have to go to the store anymore. So what do those components look like that deliver us our services and our goods? Gotcha. Okay, and then I guess maybe the big question, uh, is this a flight of fancy or does this represent some sort of reality we might experience So in the this definitely represents a reality. In fact, Toyota is going to be doing some feasibility testing in a number of different regions, including here in the U.S as early as the 2020s. Okay, okay, we're talking about early 2020s. Wow, so a very flexible platform that will move itself where it needs to go, exactly. and it can do a lot of different things, and that's just awesome. Exactly. But I can't drive it. Oh. No, you can't drive it because it is autonomous, but if you had a reason, for whatever reason, maybe working with other partners, maybe you're doing events, maybe you uh, want to host a party and you want to do it in the middle of the desert, wink, wink, now you can do it with ePallet. Now, you know what this is going to be great for? Uh, bachelorette parties. <laughs> <laughs> All my single ladies, not more anymore. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if we can end on a better note than that. Awesome. CES 2018, technology and dancing. <laughs>